shortcut keys are very important, especially when you are in the middle of editing or writing a text. And you have to access fonts, number styling, or editing options. For that, you have to remember all the relevant shortcut keys that are required or the combinations that are required to reach quickly uh, with the help of keyboard to that particular feature. Especially in Microsoft Excel, it's very common to use. But today, I'm going to share a magic key with you, which will help you to remember, even without memorizing all the shortcut keys, how to access um, your relevant feature with the keyboard. And um, in a way, I will say Excel or PowerPoint or Microsoft Word, these applications will help you to reach there. It's pretty, pretty simple and straightforward. There's a key called Alt on your keyboard. This is the key that we will use today to access most of the features that we have in these applications. So let's start with Microsoft Excel. So if you're typing something on your keyboard and you want to access something on, the, on, on your application, just simply press Alt key. Now, when I press Alt key, I can see all the options up there. So in the top bar, you can see this is the area which is my ribbon and there are tabs on the ribbon so i can access each one of those tabs with these keys so we'll go gradually inside so if i want to go in the page layout i'll press p if i want to go in the formulas i'll press m if i want to go in the data i'll press a if i want to go into the power pivots i'll press p yes and this is also applicable on the quick access toolbar you see down there so one two three four five six seven eight nine for these keys that I've already put there. And these are the formatting options. So let's say, for example, if I want to use this formatting option. Um, so what I'll do is, now I don't have anything. I'll press Alt. Then I can see there's a number 07. So I'll press 07. The moment I press 07, you can see that the theme colors are there. Now I have to press, if I want to make it a no color, I'll press N. If I want to go into the more detail of the colors, I'll press M. So from here, even I can move on to um, the key, uh, rather than the keyboard, I'll go to the mouse as well. So you can see, I can go to the mouse. So now I have the colors, I can choose any one of these colors and I can go to custom or standard format. So this is something that you can access. Again, I will say this is Alt. And when you have Alt, now if I want to go, for example, um, to the Data tab, I will have to press A. So I'll press A. You see, I'm in the Data tab now. And in the Data tab, I have all these options. So if I want to go, let's say, for example, for the subtotals, I'll have to press B now. So I'll press B. So definitely it's not possible at the moment. But this is how you can quickly access um, your shortcuts without even remembering them so application is helping you to remember those shortcuts so again alt and now i have everything in front of me i have my macros it can be played like without remembering the shortcuts so this is something easy you can also uh, take an example of microsoft powerpoint you're working in the powerpoint and uh, the moment you have to access anything you'll press simply alt now i press alt and i can see all the options there if i want to go into the designs i'll press g so this is all simply I'm using, uh, I'll say, uh, the options from old. So if I want to go to more details of uh, designs, I'm, I'll have to press H. You see, I can go now. And if I want to browse from the themes, I'll have to press M. So these are the black small keys, which I have to remember. And these will help me to go there. For example, if I want to go into the format background, I press F. So there you go on the side, you can see your format background and then you can play with it. So that's how guys you can use this alt key in your system uh, for accessing quickly uh, your shortcut keys or the shortcuts. And uh, it's very, very easy to remember. It's only one key alt and it will, it will help you to reach any way you want. You don't have to memorize. You can quickly reach there. I hope guys you enjoyed it and hope uh, you will use it in the future and it will be helpful for you. Enjoy the rest of the day and talk to you soon. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.